Hey, what's going on everybody? So I'm going to show you how you can screen mirror your Samsung Galaxy S6 directly to your HDTV. doesn't matter if it's a smart TV or a non-smart TV. Any monitor, projector, any kind of TV with an HDMI port, you're going to be able to screen mirror your Samsung Galaxy S6 or S6 Edge with a Microsoft wireless display adapter. This is basically what it looks like. You have one end here is a HDMI port and the other end is a USB. You plug the HDMI to the back of your computer and then you plug the USB port just to give this power into your USB port that you have open in your back of your TV or monitor. Or if you don't have an open slot or don't have a USB port, just plug it into the wall outlet. Now with this device here, it does come with a, a USB extender here, which you don't need to use, but uh, makes it easier to plug this in like one time in the back of your TV if your like, uh, TV is mounted onto the wall and it's hard, hard to get to the USB place, USB port in the back. So you just always have this plug in and you always have this to play with. All right, so let me go ahead and plug this in the back of my TV here. All right, so I just hooked it up to the back of my TV. Now what I got to do is go to my remote here and you want to click on source or uh, input because you want to change the source now. So right now you can see mine's on HDMI 3, so it's probably going to be on HDMI 2. So let me go ahead and select that. Give it a second here, and we should see the uh, the splash screen for the Microsoft Display Adapter. All right, there we go. And now it says ready to connect here. And simply what you do is you grab your Samsung Galaxy S6. And, and one thing I want to note too is uh, a lot of people will ask, do you need a Wi-Fi network in order to connect? And the answer is absolutely not. Okay, a lot of there's a lot of other videos out there with this um, Microsoft wireless display adapter, and they're saying that you do you do need a Wi-Fi. You do not need a Wi-Fi network, guys. You can do a direct connection. It's not a Wi-Fi network connection. It's a Wi-Fi direct. So you do not need no Wi-Fi network. And if you want to watch something that requires the internet, like YouTube videos or Netflix or browse the internet or whatever, you do, you know, you can use internet, you can, then you can use your Wi-Fi network, you can even use your mobile data, okay? So let's do this, let's go ahead and screen mirror it now, so grab your S6, you want to scroll down like this, and then you want to tap on, I think it's, uh, yeah, so scroll down and tap on the little down arrow here, and then you want to look for, they don't call it screen mirror anymore, they call it smart view on the S6 and S7, and it's a smart view right here, tap on smart view, and then, okay, it's automatically connecting to my MS Display Adapter. Give it a second here, and we're going to be connected. Okay, so we're connected now. And the thing is, if if you don't have a Wi-Fi network or, like, mobile data, um, or if you don't need it, the only thing you can do is stuff that you can do without the Internet. Like, for instance, if you have photos and videos stored locally, maybe presentations or documents for work that you want to project on a big screen, then, of course, you can still do that. Uh, let's see here. So let's just do that. Let's just go and look at some photos and videos I have here. And let me tap on here. Let me show you a photo here. Let me go ahead and move this into landscape mode here. And I can go all the way in. And by the way, this is an old TV. This is an old Sony 720p TV. This is like eight, maybe nine years old. It's very, very old, but it still works perfect. Here's another photo here. You can see the HTC symbol there. And let's go ahead and let me play a video for you. Testing, one, two, three. Testing. Let me lower down the volume. I can increase and decrease the volume right from my phone. The audio comes out of the TV. It does not come out from my phone. Again, it comes out from the TV, okay? So let's, uh, let's go back here. Let's do something else here. Let's, uh, let's watch a YouTube video and then I'll do a Netflix and I'll play a game. Here's a YouTube video. I'll press on play here. And let me raise the volume. And I'll turn this landscape. Now you do see like a very like fraction of a second lag, but that's not gonna matter if you were watching videos or if you're watching like movies and stuff like that because the audio is gonna sync with the TV. It's not gonna sync with your actual phone. Uh, let's do this. Let's go ahead and let's go ahead and go into Netflix here. And let me see if I can find a show here. 
And we'll just go with uh, Iron Fist really fast. And we'll just play the first episode here. And also what I can do, let me lower the volume down. Of course, you can go right into your subtitles. Uh, English subtitles is already on. Let me fast forward this. So you can see the subtitles are on. Of course, you can uh, go in, you can take it off. Uh, and again, you know, sometimes like my Wi-Fi here is pretty slow at my home. And sometimes I will see kind of like a, a lag, a split second lag between someone talking on my phone versus my TV. The thing is the audio will sync with the TV so you have absolute no problems, okay? Now let's go ahead and play a game. We'll play Traffic Rider here. All right, let me go ahead and increase the volume here. And I want you to look at both my phone and the TV here. See if you can see like a lag here. Let me, I think you can see it from here like this. I mean, there is like a fraction of a second lag here. So again, the, um, the game that you're playing can't be too graphic intensive or it's not gonna work very well. So let me just, Keep on playing here a little bit. You can continue to watch both the TV and my phone simultaneously. All right, so there you guys go. I think you pretty much got the message. If you guys have any questions or need any recommendations on other screen mirroring devices, uh, just let me know and that's Pretty much it. Thanks for watching, guys.